Looks like I got away with staying out late. I knew it. If you think you've got away with staying out past your bedtime, you can think again. Mum, what are you doing up so late? That's what I should be asking you, young lady. Inside, right now? Well, carry it to Barrett. Don't just stand there. Tell me why you thought it was appropriate to stay out ridiculously late, and no excuses either. I was having such a good time, I lost track of time. I said no excuses, you naughty girl. It's not an excuse, it's my genuine reason for staying out past my bedtime. No, it's a very poor excuse for your naughty behavior, and I will not tolerate it. You are 14 years old for goodness sake. I have been worried sick about you. Why didn't you try calling me then? I tried to call you 150 times, and then discovered that you'd left your phone at home. I demand to know why you didn't have it with you. It was down to 20% charge and needed charging. More poor excuses and total lies. Your phone was fully charged, as has it been all day. You just couldn't be bothered to take it with you, which is very naughty and stupid of you. Anything could have happened to you, and I wouldn't have even bloody known. Oh, I'm so sorry. My perfect mother was so worried about me. What am I supposed to do about it, I wonder? That's it. I am confiscating your phone and grounding you for a month. How dare you behave like this and expect to get away with it? You have been really naughty. What? That is so unfair. I hate you. It is so fair. You're grounded. No phone. No friends over. End of story. Get to bed, right now. How dare you speak to me like that? That took up the last of my energy for today. Time for me to turn in.